In this video, you will learn how to create a root-based IPsec VPN tunnel to allow transparent communication between two networks that are located behind different FORTA gates. The VPN will be created on both FORTA gates with the IPsec VPN wizard using the site-to-site -site FORTA gate template. In this example, the tunnel is run between two remote offices, so we will refer to one FORTA gate as HQ and the other as branch. On the HQ FortiGate, go to VPN IPsec Wizard and create a new tunnel. In VPN Setup, set template type to site to site and remote device type to FortiGate. In Authentication, for the remote device IP address, enter the public IP address of the branch FortiGate. An available interface will be automatically assigned as the outgoing interface. If you want to use a different interface, Select it from the drop-down menu. Set a secure pre-shared key for the VPN. In Policy and Routing, set Local Interface to LAN. The local subnets will be added automatically. For the remote subnets, enter the local subnet on the branch FortiGate that you want to access through the tunnel. The summary page shows all of the configurations created by the wizard, including addresses, routes, and policies. On the branch FortiGate, go to VPN IPsec Wizard and create a new tunnel, following the same steps but with references to branch replaced with HQ. For the remote device IP address, enter the public IP address of the HQ FortiGate. Set the outgoing interface and the pre-shared key. In Policy and Routing, set Local Interface to LAN. For the remote subnets, enter the HQ FortiGate's local subnet. The tunnel has now been configured, but is not yet up and running. On either FortiGate, go to Monitor IPsec Monitor to verify the status of the VPN tunnel. Right-click in the Status column and select Bring Up. A user on either of the office subnets should be able to connect to any address on the other office subnet transparently. If you need to generate traffic to test the connection, ping the branch FortiGate's LAN interface from a device on HQ's internal network. Thank you for watching. For more tutorials like this one, click here to subscribe, and you can read a written version of this recipe at cookbook.fortinet.com.